It's funny, when we were doing the 2007 eLearning Guild Mobile Learning Research Report, the team was debating what is the definition of a mobile device? Do laptops count or not? And tablets, you know, pads are really making that even more challenging to make that discrimination. And I want to suggest what's critical, you know, a desktop, uh, well, Palm actually talked about the difference between um, how you use a mobile device versus how you use a, a laptop. And laptop, you tend to sit down for a long period of time. You only use it a few times a day, but you spend a lot of time at it. When a mobile device, they found this pattern of use that's, you whip it up a number of times a day, but very quick access. And I think that sort of captures the way we use them differently. And I think it captures the opportunities and the shift in the way that they augment us. To me, you know, a laptops are, are just desktops that you can move anywhere. The only time they qualify to me as mobile is when they're doing something that you couldn't be doing at a desktop, when they're doing something uniquely to where you are and when you are. And so it's that context sensitivity that makes it relevant. And so it's sort of coupling between the context where you're at, wherever you are, and this capability that makes it a unique opportunity and makes the mobile device you know, different than the desktop because it's with you when you need it, where you need it, and it becomes more closely entwined with the context and the immediate uh, environment, and so it's more relevant in that sense. Tablets are an interesting thing because you can sit down them and do longer term engagements. I think what's going to be interesting there is that I think it's a different experience. I think, you know, instead of the hands away experience of the laptop, the tablet's more intimate with this touch screen, and I think that the that may have you know, as scientific as this sounds, I think that may have an interesting effect on the learning outcomes. So if you're engaging with a simulation like this, it may make a different experience. And I think that's uh, still a research uh, project, but I think there's in indications that that may indeed be the case.